Hi everyone, it's Gabby, and this is why I chose public health at UC Berkeley. To break down this video, I'm going to be answering why Berkeley and why public health. So without further ado, let's get started. So why Berkeley? I was not that involved with the college admissions process or even thinking about what colleges I should apply to until the end of my junior year. I did not think I was going to pursue healthcare full on, but now that I am, I decided that Berkeley would be the best place for me. The summer before my senior year, I went really deep into researching all the different colleges from UCs to privates to community colleges even, and I wanted to see everything that was available to me. All right, so three things for why I chose Berkeley in the very end. Number one, networking and having a good support system. So if you didn't know, I was admitted to UC Berkeley early. I was also offered the Regents interview so I was a candidate for the Regents and Chancellors scholarship. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to get it, but that's completely okay. There are still so many incredible opportunities I've been able to get. Being able to go to ROHP or the Regents Overnight Host Program was such an amazing and wonderful experience. I was able to actually dorm at UC Berkeley for one night and for two days I was able to network with amazing people who were also recently admitted and were candidates for the scholarship and a lot of people have gone into amazing schools whether they're going to Berkeley or another grade school. We've been able to learn from each other and I was also able to learn from current students who were majoring in public health and that was kind of my networking system. I was also able to meet people who got accepted to incredible private schools and all of these tech schools but they ultimately chose UC Berkeley and while everyone has their own personal reasons I was like, wow, I really am at a place where amazing change makers can do incredible things here. I remember this one girl, I was listening to her testimony. It was during this panel that we were listening to and she got accepted to all of these incredible institutions and colleges, but ultimately she said she chose UC Berkeley. And while she has other reasons too, she said, you can get accepted into a school, but not a lot of schools really want you. Like they're asking you to be on their campus. Like they see you on their campus. And that was UC Berkeley for her. And now it is for me too. When I was going over the schools that I got accepted into, I was like, okay, at the end of the day, honestly, the resources and the opportunities have already been given to me at UC Berkeley. And that was the best option for me. The second reason was for, again, I keep saying great opportunities, but research, internships, clubs, and just this overall community that Berkeley has to offer, especially for a campus where they house Nobel Prize laureates and researchers and writers. There are so many incredible people who have been in the workforce and are now bringing their research on campus to teach students. Overall, just being able to be in an environment where you already have everyone in front of you who have gone through that same path and they're also really niche paths you're able to already go to a campus where things are available to you. I was also able to look more into URAP or the Undergraduate Research Apprenticeship Program in which I was able to look at the different research opportunities that some students were able to pursue. And so just being aware of those things really early on really helped me with my decision to pick Berkeley. And while it's still difficult and competitive to get research or internship opportunities, you are in the Bay Area where there's so many companies and different schools and partnering organizations that are around the area for you to already be involved and all those students are there to help you so I was just really happy about the location where it was at and how everything is just kind of at your feet. The last reason is kind of an overlap between both of them. Berkeley has this incredible campus culture where students are here to help you and I was really really excited and grateful that a lot of people at ROHP were just really there for me and I would call them and just text them every so often literally in like March when people were just getting acceptances and I was already planning like you know courses that I wanted to take and clubs and different things and so through that I think that the support system and the campus culture is amazing the games are incredible the spirit is just unmatched and I just believe that all the clubs are there for you to get work experience to get part-time jobs and to get all of these research opportunities with professors and with other programs so there really was a difference between UC Berkeley with all the things that they had to offer versus other schools that I was accepted into and ultimately those three reasons are why I chose what I chose. So why public health?
When I applied to colleges, I mostly applied as a public health major, health policy major, health policy and management, political science, nonprofit management. All of those majors were kind of what I wanted to focus on. I didn't know that I was going to become a public health major, but after realizing that the public health major was capped, I thought it was going to be a great opportunity for me to just stay in here because I don't have to apply for the major anymore because I'm already an intended public health major at Berkeley. You never know where you're going to end up, but I would definitely start by listing out all the majors and just process of elimination seeing where you see yourself best. I chose public health for three reasons. Number one, the fascination of the medical field. Number two, job stability and security. And number three, it's helping others but on a wider scale. The healthcare system in America right now is so complex and there are so many things that could be worked on from the inside out. And just being able to focus on healthcare from that level is something I've always been interested in doing and you know there's always going to be a need to fix the healthcare system you want everyone to not be sick and you want everyone to get the care that they need but you know that that's not realistic so how are we able to tackle the healthcare system from a unique perspective it's very interdisciplinary which i love because public health allows you to kind of explore different paths and there isn't just one path in the medical field. The second reason is again, job stability and security. You're always going to have and find a job where people need your help. And with your background in public health, you're able to not only see things from a microscopic view, but also from a really, really wide scale. You can always find a career in public health. You can just purely do research, you can write books, you are able to go into the medical fields and become a doctor. There are graduate programs for doctors and lawyers. There is an MPH slash JD graduate program at Berkeley. There are joint medical programs at UCSF and Stanford and all these incredible schools. And so through public health, again, it's so interdisciplinary and it gives you more options. And last but not least, the third reason is that you are able to help people on a wider scale. You'll be able to analyze population health and view the statistics of how people get sick in different pandemics. Medicine is a universal language and I think it's not just treating people but connecting with them and understanding their story. And through connecting with others and by learning their story, you are able to help save lives in that sense. It doesn't have to be on a micro microscopic level or it doesn't have to be just by focusing on their brain but just by focusing on the person or the community as a whole and that is why I chose public health and that is my video why I chose Berkeley as a public health major I hope these help and again I don't know everything about it I'm just an incoming first year so I am very excited for what I'm going to learn in the public health major if you have any questions for me go ahead and let me know by connecting with me and if you like this video make sure to share it with someone who might benefit from it if you want to support me go ahead and please subscribe I would very much appreciate you and you can like this video as well and I will see you all very soon. Bye!